Hey guys, GM Pokey back here with another opening. Uh, super excited to do this one. I've not done one of these Battle Styles uh, Blue Elite Trainer boxes before, so I want to get into that. Let me just switch. There we go. This is actually a Sam's Club product. It's the Elite Trainer box, and then it has the additional um, six promo cards. And they're not actually promo cards. I think that the box says six promo cards, but I'm pretty sure they're just part of the set. I don't believe that they're labeled. Wow, it is rough to get in there. I've had some of the hardest time getting some of these things open lately. I don't know if it's just me, if you feel like it's you too. Uh, I just don't want to trash uh, the products, right? I don't want to. I don't want to bust it all up. Sorry about that. And okay, can we get? Okay, so the box itself is still also cellophane. So if you wanted to pick this up, sorry guys, as you can see, I'm, I'm just struggling with this. They have it all like taped up. Okay gonna destroy everything here um trash sorry about that so there are six promo cards that come with it and it looks like they are not actually promo cards they are just standard parts of the set uh yeah but there's six additional right so why am, okay there's one i was like why am i missing one there we go so six additional hollow cards and uh two are your sifus Right, so pretty sweet, like a martial arts guy. Kind of hits home with me. And as you notice today, uh, well, I got my 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 hat on, but um, I'm gonna switch back just so you can see. There we go. Look at that, the GM Pokey hoodie. Look at that's me, right? GM Pokey. Very very cool. Looks like a much younger version of me, but uh, I'll take it. All right, so back to this. So when you purchase the product, it is all wrapped up, but if you just wanted this as a display item, kind of like we have our back wall, I'm not gonna zoom all the way out, but you get a back wall full of uh, trainer boxes, you can do that, right? So let's kind of move everything and figure out. Now this is a new setup for me. I just started filming today here. I was filming out of a different office and we just moved here where I can leave it set up in more of a permanent filming location. But uh, the chair I have here is very, very high, and it's it compared to my table that I'm used to. So it's throwing things off. I will do my best. I appreciate uh, you sticking around. Let's look at what the contents of this box are. So as usual, there is a player's guide with these. So in this player's guide, it's going to talk about the battle style subset of Sword and Shield, go through some of the cards. It talks about uh, other stuff. I don't have time to read all this on the screen. Okay. <clears throat> so there's a Deoxy card in um, Crown Zenith where there's a bunch of floating things with chains and I'm now finally understanding that they're scrolls. I really honestly had no clue. I thought they were just logs or chains. I was totally confused. Yeah, so if you watch uh, any of the Crown Zenith openings, you'll see that. Then you have the whole card set is going to be here listed for you. A picture of each one of the cards, uh, a place for you to mark whether you have the uh, standard or or you have the reverse hollow version. And then obviously secrets only have the hollow or the foil version, whatever way they're calling it. And man, what, what are we trying to hit today, right? I mean, uh, the T-Tar the looks pretty good. I think I would like to nail that one down if we could. Uh, what else? Man, you got some full art stuff. See, tons of secrets in this box. Well, maybe not this box. All right, so... I guess, you know, there, there's kind of the gist of what it is. So there's a player's guide. Let's put that in the background. And we'll move that box top to the background. And then obviously, like normal, you get your storage box, which I really like. Um, I find that I can put um, my top loaders into the top part. And then when you pull this out, we kind of see everything we have inside. So I don't know how many packs are in this, but let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So eight battle style packs. And it looks like so far four different artworks and it's going to be two. Oh no, we got three T-Tars. Okay, sweet. And let's keep looking at what we got in here. Okay, so we have the dividers. So I, I don't know, I, I kind of like these a little bit when I have some sub boxes. I'm not really uh, storing bulk in. I'm storing some of the hollows and stuff to help me dig through for our treasure boxes and stuff. So we have got those. Uh, we'll just dump that out. Okay, let's put this back there so it's out of the way. We'll put those up against there. A whole nother pile. <laughs> if you need more energy, there's a whole nother pile of energy. Uh, we're going to use those, and there's a code card for the set, and that'll go into our treasure box also. 
we have got uh, the sleeves. So 65 sleeves, these are pretty stiff. Um, not real flexible, you're gonna put one card, and the problem I don't like is you can't see the back, so when I'm trying to send my stuff off a piece of grade, I'm trying to see what I wanna send. You can't see the back, but if you're playing, if you're actually building a deck, these are really nice and come in really handy. I suppose those back there, uh, two acrylic markers, the same acrylic markers you see in all of the Crown Zenith boxes and uh, the Fates, everything else that I've popped open, these are the same exact acrylic markers. So it'd be kind of nice if there's like maybe a little change or some, some artwork on the back. Why don't those want to display properly? Okay, there we go. And we got the dice. I like that they're blue. If I was going to use dice, I would want to probably actually, compared to what I've seen, either the Pogo ones or these ones. I really like those ones. And there's no, I didn't see a, a V-Star marker anywhere. So, I didn't, yeah, I didn't see a V-Star marker. Huh. Usually there's an acrylic V-Star marker, I thought, in there. But maybe not. Um, no, it looks like there's not. Okay, well, onward, right? So we got packs. I think that's why you guys came here today. How do we want to do this? Uh, okay, so let's do what we have two of and one of first. Right, how's that sound? Uh... How do we want to, should we do it like that? Should we do four stacks? Okay, so as we open this, you're going to see me popping down um, cards, and you're going to see um, a pile that I put down here of my uh, hits, and then piles that I put down of my non-hits. Yeah, so stick around and watch. Uh, we've been trying to do giveaways uh, after we hit about 2,000 subscribers, which we're well past now. Uh, we started doing giveaways just because, you know, I appreciate... Um, you guys stick around and watching the channel, so definitely want to give things to you for doing so. Uh, all you have to do is just enter the drawing, which I'll explain in a second, but let's get into cards. I don't think you came just to hear me talk about uh, giveaways, right? Or maybe you did. I don't know. Okay, we call this a GM Pokey Peak. Let's see if we can hit something in this position. No, and I'm not sure. Are there, were there trainer cards? I don't think there's trainer cards in battle style. Okay, ready? And no hit. All right, I guess. I don't really do my research. It's just open because it's fun to see new cards. Okay, let's see if we can get this right. No, apparently we can't. So that was a, a black code card, but the last one was, uh, I don't I don't even know. What was the last one? The last one was a black code card also, and there was no hit. So I don't have a... I don't know. Let's just keep digging through. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, we call this a GM Pokey Peak. Is there? Nope, there's nothing there. Is there something there? No, okay, so so even though we're getting black border, does this one not have colored borders? I guess I didn't, uh, I should do the research before I go opening these things, just so I don't uh, have to slow down for it. So, so far we got nothing out of this box, but that doesn't mean it's gonna stay that way. You guys cross your fingers. Okay, maybe if you drop a like on the video, we'll get something out of it. Okay, let's keep floating through. Okay, GM Pokey Peak, nothing. Is there a hit? All right, so we got the Mimi Koo, Caillou, and I think I actually, I just saw, I know I have these because I have, a, I think I have a pile of them. Yeah, I can actually see it from where I'm sitting right now. I've got a, a pile of them in, that are waiting to be part of my giveaways uh, because we're starting to give a lot of the Vs away. Instead of trying to figure out how to pack them up and sell them, we're just gonna start doing giveaways. Um, so we got one Ultra hit, and the Ultra came in the last position of the pack. So trying to figure out how these ones work. I um, don't know how many more of these boxes open, but I wanted to do a review so you can get a feel for what you would get if you purchased it. Okay, so lots of bulk and commons. Okay, GM Pokey Peak. I don't think there's anything in those hit positions. And is there a hit here? So an NTV, kind of a nice card, right? So I don't know, I don't have any idea what they return. Uh, but yeah, kind of a nice card. Let's keep going through. Oh, I, I totally forgot to talk about the drawing again. I apologize, guys. Okay, so here's how the drawing works. Uh, go to our website, and in the website, you're going to enter the um, Battle Styles Blue. So it's Battle Styles Blue Elite Trainer Box number one. So uh, Elite Trainer Box Battle Styles Blue one. You'll see it when you go to the drawings part in the uh, giveaways. And then all you have to do is enter the code. Uh, let's do Battle Styles one so battle styles one and i'll put a copy of the code down in the description to make it easy so you know what it is um, and then you go there you enter in the information and you come back here to the video and you just simply type in, in the comments entered now you could say hi 
you know, my favorite hit is, blah, blah, blah. As long as you have the word entered in the comments, uh, then, and you, and you went to the website and did the information so we can track a little bit easier, um, then you're in the drawing. Okay, is there? There's no hits in those positions. Is that, maybe actually is a rare. Is, no, no, nothing, okay. So pretty slow. We got one Ultra V, and I think it's, you know, it's a pretty inexpensive one. So I'm not sure how this one's going for a return on an investment yet. But if you're trying to complete a set, I guess so. It seemed like there were so many uh, chase cards in the player's guide. I'm just kind of confused as to why none of them are in our Elite Trainer box. Okay, what do you guys think? Is there going to be a hit here? Nope, no hit there. Is there a hit here? No hit there. Wow. Okay, so we have two packs left. The Trainer Card Pack did not produce yet. Um, we'll see. So what do you guys think? Have you had any luck with this? I had a Fusion Strike. Uh, I opened two of those boxes. Both of them were absolute duds. Uh, I pulled two really common, and it was the exact same one. Out of two boxes, one had zero hits. The other one had um, two Vs, and it was the exact same card, and it was, it was a very uh, common bulk V. So... Yeah, so what do you guys think? Is this is this box one I just did I hit a, a dud box or is it just is the product a dud box? Anything in this position? No, nothing's ever there. It looks like it maybe it's a uh, maybe that's a rare. Okay, and a Lux Ray. I have seen so many stinking Lux Rays uh, from the Crown Zenith boxes. All right, guys, last pack magic. What can we get? Uh, cross your fingers. Please enter the drawing. I want to give the stuff away. So March 15th, we'll be doing that. Look back. There was a description of how to get in there. Uh, the code's in the description. The link's in the description. And then remember, if you want any of this battle style bulk, this will go into uh, Elite Trainer Box. Uh, we call them Treasure Boxes. Link down below to check those out. It's a great way to support the channel to help us out. We get these kind of duds. And then, you know, we spent uh, money on them so we could do the opening for you guys. So if you could help me out and pick up some of our Treasure Boxes or other auctions, uh, definitely keep us going. And then we're working on a patron uh, membership thing where we can start to do some openings with you guys and a little more community involvement. Okay, so last pack of the day, last pack magic. What's it gonna be? Can we get a big hit? Can we get what's what's a big hit? Like a secret since we haven't seen anything or a V Max, something like that. Okay, nothing in that spot and nothing today. Okay, so our only hit, our solo hit, was gonna be this Mimi Caillou. And that's it. And then, you know, that was about it. So all the rest of the stuff will go into a treasure box, uh, like we like to call them. Please look at the link down below uh, because you'll be able to see uh, how to get into this drawing and then everything else we have going on. Let me get in there. So, yeah, remember the drawing for that. And then this will go into a future drawing. I can already tell you we're not holding on to it for very long. So, guys, hey, thanks for tuning in. Uh, thanks for checking out this product. What do you think? Are you going to pick one up or are you going to skip it?